We're getting you ready for the Republican primary election for Greenville County Sheriff. This week we've had exclusive interviews with the candidates, and tonight we're speaking with Sean Zukowski right now. We want to learn a little bit about your background and let the voters know a little more about you. So tell us about you. Well, thank you for having me. Um, I grew up in Massachusetts, but I did go to college in Virginia, joined the Marine Corps, active duty as a commission officer for 10 years before leaving to become a civilian law enforcement officer. I continued in the Marine Corps for another 13 years to my present day. I'm a colonel in the reserves, oh. and I've been a law enforcement officer for about 12 years now, and happy to be here and call this place my home. So tell us a little bit about what you would like to accomplish, your top goals for the Sheriff's Office. Sure. Well, the agency has lagged behind, truth be told. Um, when I first joined the agency, when we first moved here, um, they haven't kept pace with the Im Im massive growth and expansion of Greenville County and the surrounding cities. And so it really needs um, a boost in that arena, the focus and the effort and the energy to bring the agency up to uh, properly serving all of the uh, citizens of our county. It's a, it's a large county growing every day, and we could do a better job. When it comes to regaining the public trust, the office has been through an experience with uh, Sheriff Lewis uh, facing charges and being convicted. So talk a little bit about how you would regain public trust. Sure, and that starts in-house. That certainly starts inside the agency. Uh, and the focus is going to be to create the environment where uh, all the men and women that go in there day in and day out, make a choice to serve our community, uh, feel it's the proper place, feel it's a positive environment that they can come and contribute to our community. Uh, once we create that environment for them, uh, you'll see the benefits and the agency will flourish once again. Uh, there's a lack of trust or confidence inside and outside the agency and uh, I think we have the ability to move it in the right direction because it's full of the right people. It just needs the right leader. Well, when it comes to the conversation about running for office and, and going for this office, is there anything that we haven't covered here that you'd like to tell the community about to, to let them know about you as a candidate? Sure. Well, as I said, when we first moved here, we didn't have children. Um, we now have a three and a half year old and a one and a half year old, and that's really what motivates me to continue on in this arena, continue serving uh, our community, because I want to establish that this is our home, this is where our children will grow up, and I'm fiercely committed to making sure that this is as safe a community as I can for my children and everybody else's. And uh, I think we can do better to keep pace with the growth and keep the school safer um, and just really make it uh, as safe a community as we possibly can. When it comes to first day on the job, you know, a lot of people think about what will I do first sure. when I do whatever it is I want to do. What, what would you do first? Well, it's going to be a multi-step process, but certainly that first day, you have to bring a lot of the key players in to include all the way down to the, um, the, the, the employees that have the most vested in the agency, the deputies, the dispatchers, the administrators, the folks that have been there, pour their, their life into an agency like that and make sure that we're all on the same page. Make sure I understand what they need to make it an agency that, uh, that they are proud of and continue to come to work for. Well, we appreciate you joining us. You know, we're going to be giving uh, all the candidates uh, similar amounts of time and questions to be able to see what they have to say. Thank you for joining us, Sean, and we will uh, see you uh, at the polls, that, that vote coming up next week. Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it.